Welcome to Salem Gasworks, a guild of artistic sorts. We are the Arts and Entertainment Network of the North Shore. And this week, uh, the artistic sort joining us is a real icon of the Salem art scene, and that would be Mamadou Job. He is a drummer, he is a band leader, and he's a humanitarian uh, who's been awarded Humanitarian of the Year by the state of Massachusetts. Is that right? Twice. Twice. Yeah. Now, uh, Mamadou has also done a tremendous amount for the city of Salem. He founded, was one of the founders of the Culture Fest. He was a pioneer on Salem's Artist Row, where he was awarded the first stall many years ago, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And uh, the mayor personally asked him this summer to launch a concert series on the new Riverwalk to give it a boost. So, Mamadou, welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. He does it all through his music, though, so let's have a quick listen. Nobody tells me what to do I know who I am I am me Me Mamadou, that was marvelous. That is from your new album, right? Album yes. in the works, I Am Me. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. You know, it's tough to nail down your style of music. Uh, it's not reggae. It's not specifically West African. What would you call it? Mm -hmm. African world fusion music. African world fusion. Music. Mm -hmm. Wow. wow. Because of my music, uh, it uh, all kind of music combined with African influence. Mm -hmm. If you listen to the CD, you will hear reggae, you will hear something look like jazz, you will see everything. Because we try to reach many of the audience, try to get through them, and lift up their, mi their mind, and bring sense of freedom and peace in their mind. To bring a sense of freedom and peace. In yeah. their mind. Mm -hmm. Because uh, music have to be useful to people's life. For example, if you play music, try to let your leave your stamp in the mind of the listener. And in our music, we have something very powerful called the rhythm. Mm -hmm. Everybody play rhythm. Mm -hmm. The bass player, and we have too many drummers. Then we're going to talk about the drumming later on. Sure. I find when I listen to your music, um, I, I still feel it for hours afterwards. The rhythm is still there. Yeah. 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 Because the the international language of this this world, it's music. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Me, I used to dance James Brown. I even don't. I never knew one word what he's saying, and I like it. I used to dance it. You used to dance too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the problem is, if you free your mind and try to get to put, because every human being is a biological vibration. Sure. Mm -hmm. And music is a real vibration. That's I mean, if you open up yourself, you can get into insight in our music and be part and be one of with our music. And the, you will have a better understanding because you feel it. Mm -hmm. I have mm -hmm. noticed when I go to see you uh, play, whether it is in a club or whether it is on the bandstand out uh, on the fountain on, uh, uh, in Salem, I see more people move than I see. A band will, a fantastic band may be playing and people are listening, but when you play, people move, people you wouldn't expect to. Yeah, that's why they call us dancing band, not listening band. Really? Mm -hmm. People who come to our show, they have to get ready to take their shoes off and jump on the stage. Yeah, they uh, have to. That's have the to. key. You have to move mm. to it. Yeah, yeah you yeah. have to. You can't just sit and listen. Well, yeah. for, example, if you come, for example, if you come to our show, you don't move, you don't, your body doesn't move. After the show, you better go to the hospital check. <laughs> check yourself. What's there's going something on? wrong uh, with what's you. What's going on? Yeah. Well, now that's yeah. interesting. I wonder uh, your influences. Do you have any or is this completely your own? Uh, Really, I I create myself. Okay. Okay. I create myself. On many ways, for example, it's a song you are uh, 
you can be witness because you know me a little. Mm -hmm. You know that every time I wake up in my life, I'm looking for a challenge. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if I find a challenge, I try to see the way it is, break it down on micro challenges. And every time I go through one, Mm -hmm. It brings me closer to my to the achievement. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's I mean I don't believe that somebody made me or so. I I am I create myself. As the song says, I am me. Yeah, I, I create myself. I am me. Tell me about that song. I am me. That's uh, uh, of course. <laughs> I, that's, I, I am yeah. me. Sure. Uh, if I if I explain to you how that song happened, you my life. That's my son. Mm -hmm. Every time we argue, he say I am me. Your son. Your wow, son my says son. That. Say ah, dad, so he uses dad, it. <laughs> wow, dad, I am me. Uh -huh. I, that's, a, you know, that's a, my generation. And if you talk to me too, I say, GB, I am me. Yeah. <laughs> now the, the conversation is between I am me, I am me. Mm -hmm. And that inspired me. One day I say, this is a very powerful song. People claim always to be who they are. Mm. Why not? Make it on big stand, everybody, because that song touch every human being. Mm -hmm. Because people watch you from far away, they always think that they know your life better than you do. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah. They judge you. And before you point your finger to somebody, be sure that your hand is clean. That's I, true. Yeah, wonderful way to put it before yeah. you. I am who I am. Yeah. You know, this reminds me of a, a fable that you uh, you turned into a song, the one about the donkey. Mm -hmm. uh, would you mind telling this story quickly, folks? Go it's ahead. a wonderful story. No, you tell. The donkey story? The, the donkey song. Well, essentially, uh, okay. The man shows up with the donkey. Do you know uh, that one? I think the way it goes is a little boy asks his father, you know, Papa, tell me about the world. And he says, okay. Tell me if I, stop me if I get it wrong. Mm -hmm. And uh, he says, okay, I'll tell you about the world. And he takes a donkey. And uh, they ride into a village where the man is riding the donkey, and people say, oh, what a terrible man who makes his little boy walk. So the next village, the boy's on the donkey, and somebody says, what a terrible boy, he makes his old father walk. And the next village, uh, neither of them are on the donkey, and people say, what fools, they have a donkey. <laughs> <laughs> and on the fourth one, they're both on the donkey, and people say, how cruel they are to that donkey. <laughs> It, yeah, was right? in life, whatever you do, people will talk. Hmm. Uh, it's not what people talk, it's how you feel about what you're doing. Hmm. If you are in peace with your own self, yeah. the others, that's their problem. It is. Hmm. People will say what they hmm. want to say and see what they want to see. They will always say. Yeah. They will always say. For example, people talk about somebody, it's easier. It's easy for them than give help to somebody. That is very true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, that Absolutely. part, that part, I don't deal with that part. You can talk, I will keep going. Yeah. Okay. What okay. about um, now? I said it's tough to nail nail down as a musician what your style is. It's also tough as a musician to find free time <laughs> to spend with you. I looked at uh, your schedule, and there is one gig after another, and I couldn't find a, a day where you weren't busy. You might be, and you like Santa Claus. You're everywhere. <laughs> He's here, there's there. Where, where are you playing tonight? Uh, tonight, I'm going to go in Lynn, play drum. Lynn, play drum. It's a, I think they have a wedding or something like that. Mm -hmm. I, I have to go there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, the free time in my life, I don't think about that because I make I made a choice. Mm -hmm. My choice is to be a performer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I will feel very lonely, very confused if I have a lot of time. Yeah. For mm -hmm. example, if you look for success, if you get the success, you do, your life doesn't belong to you anymore. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you don't have a success, you don't have any things to chase in this life, you can lay down in your bed and sleep all day. Sure. I have a question for you. Mm -hmm. So what makes you feel like a success? Because there's a lot of things you could claim. Well, uh, what makes me feel, what, uh, uh, what I call success for me, it's to be happy 
for about what you're doing. Make a living about what you love. Mm -hmm. And be with people you love. Mm -hmm. And you, do you know what that mean? that mean? You are on the stage, you look down, everybody smile at you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everybody bright face to you. It's just so powerful to feel loved. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, you have that wow. being in the audience. I'm sorry to interrupt, but uh, that experience of being in the audience when you perform, mm. when all of your musicians perform, there is a lot of goodwill uh, and just positive energy. Yeah, I yeah. don't think that I can exchange that against yeah. for anything in the world. Yeah. To be I, a performer. To, I do mm. want to make sure that we have some time for you to play today. Will you play for us? Yeah. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about if uh, if you will about the rhythm and how it works so that we know what we're listening to what we're what we're hearing in the music. How do yeah. we experience your music? Uh you know for example uh, for example here in America the American people they don't have a better understanding about the drum. Mm -hmm. Because the drum been taken away from long time through the slave because they think that they communicate. That means the value of the drum doesn't exist here. The only drum who is kept on that rules, that's the engine drum. I mean, engine drum. The, the, the ancient uh, the, drums. Uh, the engine. Oh, the Indian, Indian, The okay. Apache. No, no, they Americans. have a drum. Okay, sure. Okay. Yeah. The drum have uh, have one kind of healing power on human being. For example, if you play the bass of the drum, this you can feel it on your body. Mm -hmm. This. Human body absorb everything. Mm -hmm. like that means this is the yeah. control of the body. If uh, if you see all spiritual drum, they are busy. The the engine drum, they are busy. Oh, that's this. The heartbeat. Wow. Mm -hmm. And this is the emotion. This. Ah. Mm. For example, if you are thinking harder, you catch yourself doing those kind of noise like. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is emotion. Bon, the other one, if I play it, you're going to say it's loud. It's not loud because it attacks right your brain. That's this one. Uh -huh. this. That. Yeah. It's a different than this one. It's a different than this one. Yes. Yeah. The slap attack. For example, what the human being is made by emotion, body, and brain. Mm -hmm. sure. okay. If you control those kind of sound, you project it on the right way to the person you want to heal, you get through. Mm. So it is a language of communication. It's a language. Yeah. Yeah. For example, you, you catch the people's uh, brain, catch, control his body, control his emotion, you can feed him everything mm -hmm. missing and fix where it was wrong. Mm -hmm. Will you talk to us? <laughs> Will you talk to us on the drum with Adam? <laughs> How yeah. about this? Yes? Well, How yeah, about we can that? do that. Yes? How about this? We'll take, uh, we'll take a minute to look at a, a quick announcement, and when we come back, it'll be Mamadou Job, joined by Adam Zampino, and uh, touching our emotions and our, our uh, hearts and our minds. Hearts yeah. Thank right. you. Be back Thank in a moment. You. Thank you. Tyrone is a man with a lot on his mind. He has many things to say, but feels that he has no voice. Then, one day, a friend called. The friend told him about Salem Access Television, a place in his community where he could produce and broadcast his own television shows. Tyrone went down to 285 Derby Street in Salem and went inside. Once there, he signed a membership agreement and paid a small annual membership fee. He was then given the orientation and all of the training he required to produce his own television shows by the expert and friendly professional staff. Tyrone got it. He is now ready to be heard. Look guys, it's not babysitting when they're your own kids. And what about when it's cold outside, everything freezes but the fluids in your face and a perfect guy? SATV, make your reality television. Welcome back. In our break, we were joined by one of Mamadou's bandmates. So, ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you Mamadou Diob and Adam Zempino.
mani de mona jurur mani dalu bay pun jai mani nang nya bari niro samba mani ranye samba mani riki buraka mani bombal maji jawaban suka bombailar mani jam jami polor mani boto jajar gui samba laude Okay, the next song gonna be Kuku. It's a rhythm from Guinea, West Africa. Yeah, I am glad the yeah. cameras weren't on us. We were kind of doing, you know, silly looking uh, <laughs> audience <laughs> things over here. You know, it um, certainly the sound comes via Senegal and Mamadou comes via Senegal. He is originally from Dakar. Mm -hmm. And uh, and you came to the U.S. in what year? 1996. 1996. Mm -hmm. 1996. And did you come directly to Salem? No, no, no. Uh, the, it was after World Tour. We went to Europe for more than two months. Mm -hmm. Went to Canada and get here. After here, we supposed to go to Jerusalem. To, I'm to where? Jerusalem. Uh, Jerusalem? Israel. Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Oh, Israel. Okay. And after, on a magical way, I, I'm here. Mm -hmm. I say I'm not going anywhere. I'm tired to not belong. I never belong to anywhere. Sure. Uh, I left my uh, my, my hometown, went to tour for three months, come back for two days, go back, come back, go back. That's mean I don't know. I don't, you know, I am never, I couldn't say this is where I live. Mm -hmm. I know people from France, from Germany, from Switzerland, from... Holland, I am, but I don't belong to any of, and I say, okay, I decide to belong to somewhere. 
So you found your home in the city of peace. Yep. Yeah, the new the new Jerusalem, right? The Salem's name actually comes from the Hebrew uh, Jerusalem. Salam. Mm, yeah. mm, salam uh, mean peace. Shalom, mm. salam in, in the Muslim. Shalom on yeah. on Hebrew. Yeah. Salam on Arab. Yeah. yeah. You know. So what what made you select uh, Salem? I don't think that I selected Salem. Salem, Salem selected me. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Really? What were your first days? Or? Yeah, because when I I was in New York, moved here to my brother in Cambridge, have a show in Marblehead, met my wife, and marry her. Mm -hmm. I don't like live in Marblehead because I need more energy and I don't find myself there. I move out, rent apartment here in Salem yeah. because Salem have that kind of vibration I needed to to feed my soul. Yeah. Okay. And I really and I buy a house, mm -hmm. and that's it. Mm -hmm. I am and try to be more useful to the community yeah. mm -hmm. on many ways, and I think I'm happy in Salem. I think Salem's happy to have you here. Yeah, actually, absolutely. we noticed that. Uh, uh, you had received a, uh, what was the award that you received from the Chamber of Commerce for? Uh, no, that's not really my award. That was the award from, uh, for, the, for A3D, mm -hmm. for the humanitarian action we're doing here and in Africa. Mm. Because they follow us. Sure. They follow us and they see what we're doing. And they, I got a lot of awards, mm -hmm. a lot. Mm -hmm. Some I would I even don't know what that means. Sure. You know, uh, just I get it because they give it to me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, know? don't do anything Just do what more, you right? do. What, the, yeah. uh, what does, as an artist living in Salem, mm -hmm. uh, what does Salem do well, uh, well for its artists? Uh, Salem, it's a welcoming city. Mm -hmm. And I'm very glad to talk about the mayor. The mayor, wow. The mayor try and, and she's a hard worker and really if she wasn't hard worker I will tell you I will tell I will say that you know me. She's a very hard worker and she tried to put Salem together on better way. Yeah. The problem is not uh, the city of Salem. It's not the art, it's the people mm -hmm. of Salem. Mm -hmm. For example uh, the day The power of love take over the love of power in Salem. Salem will be heaven. You think so? So what do you mean specifically? You're uh, talking about the arts community or? Everybody think that he, Salem belong to him. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a, there, uh, is a, there is a lack of um, unity he, at times. Uh, Sometimes these groups are great at working mm -hmm. together and these groups are great at working together and this group is, um, I think, a cohesiveness of voice well, is if we important. can for example build up a big team and all back up the work of the mayor mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. people gonna move out Boston to come leave Salem if, it's if no people, teamwork it's individual people working together mm. Yeah. Mm. and it needs to be more of a more of a community, well, community. Artists. yeah yeah, yeah. I've been concerned about that myself because um, pe people do talk about the resurgence in Salem that have come and gone and come and gone, and I do see that the arts being more unified is a key um, because no matter where you travel in the world, and my brother went to Moscow, and you know even they understand for different reasons the power of of um, investing in the arts. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that's the key to making people who live here want to stay mm -hmm. and drawing people, as you said, to come in from Boston and mm -hmm. want to stay. People who work here in the courthouses to want to move here and stay. I yeah. think it's key. Yeah. yeah. And, and you know, you know, the uh, Salem himself, it's art. Because Salem, yes. even if you never get here, you heard about Salem. Mm -hmm. It's a history. It's a story. It's a big story. It's a lot of things. People, even in Salem, believe uh, on Salem, who makes Salem different than any city. Yes. The problem is like uh, the teamwork. People need 
to clean their hearts and try to come together and because this is our city if everybody bring the best you can the best you are yeah on, ev- all well, the boats rise ev- every everybody single, rises yeah. together Absolutely. but that's that problem i uh you know me i stay say what i think mm-hmm. i don't believe that most of the people here work for the community they work for themselves mm-hmm. i don't believe it me uh, for example let's take us we support the hard work more than 10 years the hard work never pay us any penny the what 10 years we support the hard the, the the work for hard H A W C. Wow. Ten years we play their show. Uh-huh. We play their key. We don't ask them nothing. Nobody know who we are. We are even not on the fly. After we park our stuff, go. Yeah. Every the hunting happening, the beginning. We every I ask all the mission drummers to come. We play. Nobody know who we are. Nobody hire us. We try to be part of the community. Mm-hmm. If you go the uh, the uh, cancer walk. We are playing drum every year for the council walk. Mm-hmm. We try to connect ourselves to the community. For example, more. For example, let's uh, take the summer concert series. The summer concert series, the one that you started well, on the river walk. When I had that idea, I exposed it to the mayor. I said, "The mayor, Salem have something who bother me, because the point mm-hmm. they don't they don't enter they don't come to Salem." It's like two different city. Okay, so the people on the well, point the, is very they don't young. come. People on Salem they don't go to the point. Yeah. Why not build up a common common ground where we can have both uh, uh, neighborhood yeah. together? Yeah. Mm-hmm. When I say to the mayor, the mayor say I don't. The mayor say I don't like it, but I just love it. Yeah, I I think it was a brilliant idea to bring music to that area. That's true. Yeah. For example, people need to know that uh, if we build the Salem, we build, the, we will build it for our own self, not for somebody else. Mm-hmm. For our own self, it's going to be nice to live here. It's going to be welcoming. Mm-hmm. It's going to be wonderful. Yeah. You know, you're not doing uh, this past year was the first year, and uh, after six of them, there was no uh, Salem Culture Fest, mm-hmm. which you and A3D mm-hmm. uh, organized. Why was there no Culture Fest this last year? Yeah, because. Uh, uh, A3D don't we don't want to lie to people mm-hmm. because we raise money to buy a computers and table and desk to bring it to some school we sponsor in Africa. Mm-hmm. Some in Senegal these well, in Senegal. In Senegal. Sure. Okay. And some people ready give us money. Mm-hmm. And even more than three years we collect those money. We say if we go to we try to organize the Salem Culture Fest, it's going to take the entire year. Mm-hmm. Let's free this time and accomplish our mission. Mm-hmm. The time we have to focus on the Salem Culture Fest, we are focusing on connect ourselves to Africa. How we're going to bring the computer there? How many computers okay. we're going to buy? That's this year we set off the culture set culture festival. Yeah, fest to, for example, finish the work. Sure. Yeah. Are you going? Are you going there soon? We're going to in Africa Jan- on January. In January. So, yeah. um, where are you in the process? Are you looking for people to join you? Are yeah. you looking for donations? Still, all of the above. Both. Yeah. Uh, the the I. It's a two trip. It's a tourist trip because every two years I brought people with me in Africa because Senegal, it's a country, amazing country. That's where the slavery start. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. For example, if you go to Senegal, it's uh, one island called Gore Island. That's where they used to park the slave. That door on the back, it's uh, what they call the last door. Whoever go on that door, you never come back. That means that island is still there, sponsored for, uh, well, sponsored by America. Sponsored by America. America is sponsored that island. To, because of... Uh... No, that's because it's a black American history there. Sure. Okay. Sure. So America contributes to. Well, contribute. Uh, no, they they to keep the things like a, a museum. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so what do you bring? Because um, I want to make sure that our audience understands what you're doing. Because I know that we're going to have to wrap up soon. Um, what is it that you would? What do you need from us right now? Do you need people to uh, do it for you? I need um, I need some people to to welcome some people to experience their lifetime trip. 
people to go. Uh, so yeah, for example, I, orga- I am a trip organizer mm-hmm. and I am a humanitarian too. Mm-hmm. For example, we combine both. So how many slots do you have available? For, six. You have six people that can uh, join you on uh, this trip. Six. As you distribute all yep. of these computers and things to the schools. They're going to have an amazing time. And yeah. Now, are you also at this point looking for um, computers and things like that? Or, or would more money of a financial contribution No, be the faster? computer is going to be very hard. Because if we buy it here, ship it there, it's easier to go there, buy it. And buy it. Okay. Uh, so okay. That's mean we wire money there, buy mm-hmm. the computer, it's ready, there, it's there waiting for us. So where do people find the um, your charity? Uh, how do they find it on, online? Um, we are online. www. a three d a the the letter a the number three d has a dog a three d inc dot org a three d inc a three d inc dot org okay. Wow. okay. Wow. And how do we find you? Your music. Uh, my my music. Uh, if it's about the band, it's a uh, Mamadou.com. Mamadou.com. Yeah. Okay. Mamadou.com. Uh, you can contact me directly now, or if you want to contact the business side, you contact info at Mamadou.com. Okay. If you want to contact me directly now, Mamadou at Mamadou.com. Okay. And yeah. also, you can always connect with us at mm. Gasworks to follow anything and everything. I hope you'll keep us posted so that we can keep our audience posted yeah. what you're doing. Yeah. Um, I think we're getting a cue to wrap up again. This went so fast. Mamadou, thank you so yeah, much for, you for spending welcome. time for us today and welcome. giving us a little something I to I forgot to talk about my flyers, my flag. This is your Tell flag? Tell us about your flag. Yeah, that's Senegalese flag. I, I green, win. yellow, red. Yeah. I live with, I walk with, I work with, mm-hmm. I think mm-hmm. with this. With with that's why I have my flag all the time because that's this who make me who I am right now. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank so you. So if you've liked what you've seen today on Salem Gasworks, we've been sitting with Mamadou Diop, who has been the Boston International, um, you say it for me, it's this big. It's an international Boston. artist of the year. We won the award last year. For the Boston Music nom- Awards. We are nominated this year, too. And you're nominated a second year. Yeah. Great. Thank you. So you can keep up with what Mamadou is doing at SalemGasWorks.com as well. Mm. And we hope if you like what you've seen in the show today, you'll follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Have a great day. Thank you. Mm. Flag of Senegal. Yep. Yeah.